morning, STN. Today marks the day of Yaqub Sayyid's passing. A year ago today, he was tragically killed, and I would like to say a prayer for him. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit, amen. Dear Father, we're here to say a prayer for our friend Yaqub Tyreek Sayyid. As we reflect on the joyful moments we had with Ty, we are reminded to remain appreciative for the short time we had with him. To also cherish the memories we shared and you hold and you hold you close in our hearts. O oh Allah, forgive Yaqub and elevate his station amongst those who are guided. Enlarge for him his grave and shed light upon him in it. We love and miss you, Ty. May you continue to rest in peace. In the name of the Father and of the Son and the Holy Spirit, Amen. Now we have a quick memoriam we'd like to share with you guys. Tariq was just like such a sweet soul. Even in the hallways, if you didn't know him, if you weren't friends with him, like you just come up to you, say hi, like make sure you're having a good day. And even though like some people like make fun of him, like that didn't bother him. He just made everyone's day and like he changed everyone's life. You know, it's been tough ever since I lost my friend, uh, Yakub Tyreek. He used to put a smile on my face when, you know, I was going through some things. He was just a great, genuine friend. He always cared about other people. Uh, last year Halloween this, he was slow dancing with a girl and he, he was like really happy, right? He was really happy and then I looked over his shoulder, this guy was sticking his tongue at me and all that. He was just happy. Yeah, he was cool. He was like my height. We would always fight about like who's the tallest. He was a pretty cool guy. You know, loved his energy. Tyreek was very humorous and funny and kind and loving to everyone around him. He never showed any animosity to his friends. He was very real and he was very comforting to me. And it just breaks my heart that I had to witness and go through that. May he rest in peace. Rest in peace, Tyreek. We miss you. I miss seeing you around the halls and laughing with you. I remember when I stayed for a basketball game with you. Rest in peace. We love you. Tyreek was a great soul. He meant a lot to everyone at STM. Whether you were sad, mad, he always found out a way to cheer you up with his goofy jokes. He will never be forgotten. Rest in peace, Ty. Grade 12s, do you need community service hours while looking to help those in need? Well, you're in luck. Once again, the Canadian Blood Services are looking for donors. You can get up to eight community service hours. The donation date is the morning of Friday, January 19th, and transportation will be provided. Sign-up sheets and permission forms are instant success. Limited spots are available, so don't delay. If you have any questions, please see Ms. D. Giovanni in student success. Organized by your STM prefects. Thanks, STM. An organ transplant recipient may also need blood. That's why we need donors every day. There are lots of reasons to donate blood. Canadian Blood Services. Book now at blood.ca. Hey there, FDM. Do you like music? If your answer is yes, you'll want to mark your calendar for January 17th, when you can see the wildest, most exciting concert of the year right here at FDM. Our awesome lineup includes amazing bands like Van Hammy, Five Star, LTN, and my band, Seven Feet Deep. Tickets can be bought on School Cash Online for $5 or at the door on the day of the event. The concert will take place at 7 p.m. in the cafeteria. What are you waiting for? Buy a ticket and I'll see you there. Good morning, STM. My name is Boonie. And my name is Sophia. And here are your announcements for today. The library is reminding all students that all library materials are due for return by Monday, January 22nd. If the materials are not returned by January 22nd, they will be marked as lost and you will be charged a replacement fee. There will be a diversity meeting today after school in the library. This announcement is for all students with an IEP. Please check your school email for important exam information from your resource teachers. And now for your sports. Congratulations to the Novice Girls Volleyball team on their win against Cathedral last night. A great effort by all. A reminder of our practice tonight at 5 p.m. Please be on time. Thank you from your coaches Tillotson, Barclay, and Abraham. Last night in the game of the night with a packed home crowd, your junior boys basketball team played arch rival Cathedral. After being down by 10 late in the fourth quarter, your junior knights came storming back. Jaden Meritim tied the game with two baskets in five seconds after sending it to overtime. After the first overtime, the game remained tied, heading into the second overtime. Your Junior Knights rallied to win in double overtime 85-80. to 80. Your Junior Knights remain in a three-way tie for first. It's night time. Thanks, SDM. 
Tariq's Locker by Niobe Ogunjabi. It became a place to gather and grieve, rather than laugh at the sound of his screams, blasting music in our ears in to avoid these tears. I miss walking the hall and hearing his screams, but now it is simply a reminder of January 11th, 2023. When we say RIP, we don't mean rest in peace, but rather rest in power. For his legacy endures through the lives he touched and the people he changed. Rest in power to Tyreek. STM, those are all of your announcements. The time is now 8.19, and remember, it's a great day to be a knight.